The other thing that we do here at the office, which I think sets us apart, is we've been doing sleep apnea testing and screening for the last 20 years. It started with kids, actually, and uh, sleep apnea is something that a lot of people have. It's a misdiagnosed or undiagnosed problem across America. It's getting a little bit more uh, attention uh, because they have tracked it to uh, car accidents, work productivity, quality of life, and then chronic diseases, cardiovascular, diabetes, cancer, Alzheimer's, everything is sleep quality. And we started doing this with kids with uh, tonsils and adenoids. The ENTs, for example, in Mason City are taking out tonsils and adenoids due to sleep apnea in kids more than they ever did for strep throat. And they're seeing a huge difference. Kids shouldn't be snoring. And kids don't get enough sleep, they are restless, they have behavior problems, and they just aren't thriving. So we started that with the kids and referring a lot over to the ENT, but now with adults, a lot of people have sleep apnea and that's partly genetics, partly anatomy, but also part of our lifestyle. We're getting uh, packing on more pounds, so to speak, and that increases the sleep apnea. Historically, the gold standard has been uh, CPAP. CPAP works, but it's a 50% failure rate after one year and basically because people are not compliant, they don't wear it. And so we have some oral devices that will uh, help and solve that problem. We're actually getting referrals from the ENT neurology to use the oral devices, which have been proven to work, FDA approved, because if you can't wear the CPAP, if you're not compliant, we need something in there. I've been my own patient for the last seven years. I was on the verge of getting kicked out of my own bedroom because uh, of the snoring and uh, I sleep better, uh, quality of life is better, and so we really have been helping a lot of people with that. And we screen it on every patient, and we have for the last 20 years. So I think we're on the forefront of that, uh, we're all trained in that, and uh, we do a very good job with that.